Years in the making, Mobile City leaders finally passing some new zoning regulations. However, some people who live in a historic community are concerned about what that might mean for them. Fox News reporter Ashlyn Nichols is live in the studio now with the story. Ashlyn. Lanisa and Byron, Sandtown is the oldest African-American neighborhood in the Spring Hill area. After the Mobile City Council passed some new zoning and development regulations yesterday, some people who live there have raised concerns. Tucked in one small corner off Spring Hill Avenue, there's a historic marker recognizing Sandtown. Established before 1845, Sandtown was built by former slaves. Longtime resident Earl Safford believes in the importance of preserving the community. We're only trying to make it better, not only for ourselves because we live here, but for the world to see. Others, like Rosa McCoy, attend church at Mount Hebron in Sandtown. She worries the new regulations will allow businesses to take over the area. To be able to remember the blessing that God has left here for generations to come, then I believe that we ought to preserve our history and thank God for each and every one that will be coming behind us. In response, Mayor Stimson says the new regulations are a good thing, but protecting Sandtown is also important. A giant step forward while at the same time protecting uh, the environment that we have, connect, protecting our communities and our culture. The Mobile City Council says they will work with the Sandtown residents to help them meet their needs. Reporting in Mobile, Ashley Nichols, Fox 10 News.